I feel like friends are harder to make when you quit letting your surface level self describe who you are. There was a rat race of popularity that I had to let go of. And it was based on attraction. I think the funny people get this. I think the people who made their way through school using their humor totally understand what I'm talking about. Because they had to formulate their personality in order to climb this rat race. And what skills were they given once popularity didn't mean shit? They knew how to formulate their personality. They knew how to break it down. They knew how to think about what worked. And once they figured out that they don't want to work for the rat race, they decided, what's going to work for me? So my life has been figuring out what works for me since high school now. And it's about my personality, not these physical changes that I post online. Oh, his hair's longer. This is why I post in videos on Instagram. I don't post pictures. I post thoughts that show some of the things I learned that describe how my mind has changed. I can't post in pictures. Even the art that I've posted on Instagram, it has a message behind it. And I've just realized that I'm not going to be posting art unless it's got a video explanation connected to it. I am trying to explain my mind. I'm not trying to explain my environment or how it's changed. And this is probably why I am not friends with anybody from high school. Like, no, no deep, strong, solid connections with anybody. Because I think I've been waiting for the right people to find me. And that also means that I had to spend some time figuring out who I was. Because if I want to attract like-minded individuals, I need to have an understanding of my mind, right? Once I became more than just this body that wanted to be attractive for the sake of catching a nut <laughs> or being with somebody in high school, my mind had a lot of catching up to do. And now you see it. The mind has caught up with the body. Sometimes you gotta let yourself go, you know? You gotta quit trying to look pretty and hot, whatever. So that your other aspects of yourself your mind and your spirit can catch up and do the growing that you put into your other aspect of yourself, your body. It's a balance of this trifecta of the self, the mind, the body, and the spirit. And once those are aligned and you have a better sense of self you can start attracting that same energy
if you are still superficial, you're going to attract superficial energy. Your relationships are going to be two-dimensional instead of deep. Three-dimensional. And that's unfortunate. I know that we are all changing in some way, and there's no right way to change. This is all just my opinion. But for those who are not embracing it, I will pray for you. I will pray that you begin to go with the flow and listen to what life is trying to guide you towards. Peace and love, baby.